Hello, good day. Welcome to another Federation and HVAC mechanic red cell license exam reviewer. Today's topic is calculation of total current in a refrigerated fixture. So this is our problem here. This problem is taken from the sample questions on uh, redseal.ca and this is the wording of the uh, problem. A refrigerated fixture has 208 volts power supply and the following loads. One strip mullion heater rated at 3 amperes. Two defrost heaters rated at 6 amperes each. Four evaporator fan motors rated at 9 watts each. Six fluorescent lights rated at 40 watts each. What is the operating average of the system? So, like always, we wanted to list the given. So, we've got 208 volts as the power supply. We have 3 amperes mullion heater. We have 6 amperes defrost heaters times 2. We have 9 watts evaporator fan motors times 4 and 40 watts fluorescent lights times 6. Unknown is the operating amperage of the system. So I have two solutions. So the first one is solving for the total resistance first. And the second one is just adding the individual currents. So all the loads are connected in parallel in this case. So we calculate the total resistance of the circuit, RT. First one, we calculate the resistance of the mullion heater. RMH is voltage over amperes is 208 divided by 3 we got 69.3 ohms next we calculate the resistance of the two defrost heaters and they're in parallel uh, connection so we've got 208 divided by 6 plus 6, 208 divided by 12, we've got 17.3 ohms. Next one we calculate for the resistance of the four evaporator fan motors. We know the power formula is equal to I times E, but in this case we're, we're uh, solving for the I. So power divided by E is equal to I, so we've got 9 watts times 4 divided by 208 volts, we've got 36 over 208, we've got 0.173 amperes and after we solve for the current now we solve for the resistance of the evaporator fan motors voltage over I current is equal to 208 over 0.173 the point 173 is the one we calculated above so we've got 
uh, the resistance of the evaporator fan motors was 1202 ohms next one we calculate for the resistance of the six fluorescent lights so we follow the formula just like the formula above I equals P over E power 6 times 40 watts divided by 208 volts we got 1.15 amperes then we solve for the resistance of the fluorescent lights voltage over I 208 over 1.15 1.15 is the one we solve above and so we get 180 ohms now we solve for the total resistance of the whole parallel circuit so the generic formula is 1 over resistance total is equal to the reciprocal of the individual resistances the sum of them so we've got 1 over RT is equal to 1 over resistance of mullion heater plus 1 over resistance of defrost heaters plus 1 over resistance of evaporator, evaporator fan motors plus 1 over resistance of the fluorescent lights. So we substitute the values we calculated above and we've got 1 over RT 0 0.0786 and we've got the total resistance of 12.72 ohms now that we've got the total resistance of the circuit we can calculate the total current so total current is equal to voltage over resist total resistance 208 divided by 12.72 is equal to 16.3 amperes that's our answer solution number two is we add all the currents total current is equal to 3 amperes that's the current of the mullion heater plus 6 times 2 that's the current of the two defrost heaters plus 0.173 that's the current of the evaporator fan motors and 1.15 is the current of the fluorescent lights and so I'll add them all together and then we arrive at the same answer okay i hope you learned something from this and till next time thank you